I'm standing in the front room of a house, a Renaissance house, built in 1545, which became, in the 17th century, for three generations, the residence of the de la Salle family. It was here, in 1651, on the 30th of April, that the first child of Nicole Moe de Bruyere and Louis de la Salle was born. This child was christened Jean Baptiste. He is the subject of our story. It was in this house that many other children were born. It was a house of great happiness, shared, however, by two families. It was a house of sadness because three of the children died soon after birth. It was from this house at the age of 10 or 11 that John Baptist de La Salle went to the Archbishop's Chapel one day to actually receive the tonsure when a piece of his hair would have been cut as a sign to others that he was destined to be a priest. It was here at the age of 15 years and nine months that he was made a canon of the Cathedral of Reims, a great honor, largely due to the work of the family in obtaining this position because of the resignation of a close relative. It was here also from this home that John Baptist de La Salle would have started school at the age of 10, walking up to the College for Les Bons Enfants, not too far away, but followed by his own valet carrying his books for him. It was in this house also that finally it was decided that the place was too large, or too small really, for the large number of children and adults now occupying it, and the family was to move. What's been preserved here in the house, exactly in the style of the 17th century, are a whole set of books, furniture, and so on like that. The great fireplace, for example, which would have been very important during the winter months. We have certain signs also, important moments of de La Salle's life. A picture of him as the canon of the cathedral before his 16th birthday. A painting showing the vessels he would have used at mass, his own chalice and his pattern. A portrait of Nicolas Roland, a canon, a relative of de La Salle, who also was his spiritual guide. And finally, a painting of John Baptist de La Salle standing at the door of the Sisters of the Infant Jesus and receiving the letter brought him by his relative Jeanne Maillafer to Rouen. It was this letter that was to change his life and bring us here to commemorate him.